Right everyone, web collector here. This is a video I promised someone I'd do a long time ago. Uh, they wanted a review of my fair barn type fighting knife. And I've recorded this a couple of times and I was never really happy with it, so this is the third time I'm doing it. Um, this one should be better. I'm going to do a bit more information, read some information from this book. Handheld Encyclopedia, uh, the Encyclopedia of Handheld Weapons. It's got a section about the fair barn socks there. About how I got this knife, so I'll tell you that first. Right, this was my dad's, still is my dad's. Well, I suppose it's mine now. This one's actually got no markings on it. So I don't know if it's original. It certainly is old though. The sheath isn't original. It never had a sheath with it, so I had to buy a new one. But it's an exact copy of the original sheaths. And I got that from the British Knife Collectors Guild for something like 15 quid, I think. And they had to custom make it. So that's basically all the info I can tell you about it from what I know. So then I'll, uh, I'll go over some specifications from the book. Right, so the manufacturer of these knives was the British War Office contractors, so that's probably dip many different companies. The model is Fairbairn Sykes Fighting Knife. Overall length is 11 and 5 eighths inches long. The blade is 7 inches. The blade shape is tapered diagonal section dagger blade. It's carbon steel. Bevel ground. The grip is a cast to zinc alloy ringed with characteristic bottle shape. Right, construction full length rat tail type tang of rounded nut at pommel screwed onto the thread end of tang. And then the sheath is brown leather sheath with metal chap or shape, belt loop and tabs for attaching to clothes. That's these. And the black elastic to hold the knife in position. That's there. Now that's the specifications of basic info of it. So I've read a little bit from this book. The legendary Fairbairn Sykes. Is perhaps the most widely known military knife of all time. A classic that has become synonymous with daring Second World War commando raids and still adorns the cap, badges and insignia of elite British units. Certainly is a nice knife, one of my favourites. Love the shape, the double edge. The commandos were formed in the 1940s to carry out raids, to destroy enemy installations and obtain information. Captains Fairbairn and Sykes had served with the Shanghai Municipal Police and were experienced in martial arts and hand-to-hand -hand combat. They were put in charge of teaching or they were put in charge of teaching close combat fighting skills at the Commando Basic Training Centre in Aknakari. McGarry in Scotland. I've probably said that wrong, that name. Um, I won't read all of this, but basically goes on to say how they designed it. Um, I'll put some more information in the more info section, but that's basically it. It's a fighting knife. I don't know if mine's original or not. Certainly not a Wilkinson Sword one, because uh, Wilkinson Sword made some of them. Um, it is a nice knife, nice shape, nice grip. Designed for fighting. Right. I hope you liked it. See you later.